This HAN Network video is brought to you by Carl Chevrolet. We're at Fairfield Ludlow High School, and sailing is somewhat of a co-op team. There's one Fairfield Ward member, and this is one time I can get away with saying the W word. I'm Rob Adams with Bill Bloxham. Don't know if this is a, a good sailing day or not. Probably not, but we're going to let them tell us as it's a little bit of dicey weather outside the HAN Cruiser. But as always, let them introduce themselves. What's your name? My name is Cameron Nash, and I'm a junior. And I'm Emery Wallace, and I'm a senior. So is today a, a good sailing day? I mean, personally, I wouldn't want to go sailing in this. It's pretty uh, miserable out there. Yeah. But uh, it seems windy, so we have practice today. All right, we're going to improvise. Bill, I'll hand it over to you. Thanks. Uh, talk to me a little bit about, I mean, this type of weather, is this kind of what you get used to somehow? Yeah, it's pretty common in the spring season, especially to have weather like this. Um, so we all just wear a lot of layers in our dry suits and you get used to having cold hands. But Somehow it's easier when you're speaking to a baseball or a softball player say, oh, so you played Little League and that's how you worked your way up. How do you work your way up in sailing? There's actually a lot of programs on the Long Island Sound. Um, so a lot of us started in JSA and you sail at just yacht clubs around here starting when you're eight and just go from there. Take the microphone back, and uh, Emery, I'll, I'll come back to you. Uh, and as I drive up and down Route 34, I always see them sailing out on, on the Housatonic. You're going to Yale, is that true? Yeah, it is. That's <laughs> great. Congratulations. We'll see you out there. What made you want to go to Yale? Um, my uncle went there and my grandpa as well, so I have a bit of a legacy, and I've always loved the campus and have heard great things about it. So Nothing to not like about them. How about your favorite regatta? I noticed you, you made note of it on your sheet. We were actually lucky enough to qualify for the Atlantic Coast Championships this fall, and so we drove down to Norfolk, Virginia um, in November and spent a couple days there racing against teams from all over. Boy, that sounds like a great experience. How about you, Cameron? You got a favorite experience? Well, personally, I like the uh, O'Day Regatta, which is a regional qua qualifying regatta for national championship. It's held every April in Newport, and our team goes there, and uh, we do pretty well there, so I like it a lot. So Newport's a great town also. Uh, as a, you both noted that you're a starting skipper, communication has to be so important. Yeah, you know, it really is because the combinations, the winning combinations will change so fast. So you constantly be talking to your teammates, making sure that everybody's on the same page before something else happens. You mentioned that um, veteran, veteran uh, crew coming back. Is that a comfort to know that, you know, from your success last year, you can just build off that? Yeah, we were all very excited to coming into this season um, with pretty much all the same starters that we had last year. Five out of the six stayed. Um, and so it was nice. We had the fall to practice a lot and just improve our team racing skills. Best of luck to both of you. Have a great Thank season. You. Hopefully we'll get you some better weather. <laughs> Thank yeah. you very much. And best of luck at Yale to you. As we talk sailing here at Fairfield Ludlow High School, and, of course, a tip of the cap to the one member from Fairfield Ward. So it's all about Fairfield sailing here on the HAN Network.